This is one of my two Eero devices. This one is hooked directly into the internet. The other Eero device is placed wherever you need your Wi-Fi signal to be boosted. And then this is the second half of my two-part Eero set that is connected just to the electrical outlet and it is in the room with my TV. See, there's my TV, this is in my family room, there's Yeti. Now the Eero is about six inches square diameter and it's about an inch and a half in the front and then two inches in the back. And this part of it just simply connects to the electrical outlet. This is to boost the signal from the Wi-Fi upstairs by where my actual co wall connector is for the internet. This boosts it throughout the whole house, which is super, super helpful if you have multiple devices. And I just have the main Eero sitting up here by where my internet connection is. This has the connection to the internet and the other connector and then the power connector. So I can effortlessly use my desktop computer, my laptop computer, our 85 inch TV, which is connected to YouTube TV and all tons of other streaming apps. This TV, that computer, and it also connects to all of our devices throughout our whole house. The cell phone that this is going on right now, the computers, my husband's cell phone, any family member's cell phone, all at the same time, it like boosts that signal big time throughout our entire house. Everything works at once versus having one TV going in one room and then the other one's kind of glitchy and freezes up as well as both laptops freeze up at the same time. Instead, everything works with one device. And this Eero box just simply has just the plug going from the Eero to the wall. It does have, have room for those two connections that I showed you previously, but you just need to plug those two connections into just one of the two boxes. The other one just simply needs to be plugged into the wall. Now, when your internet goes out, this light, which is normally, this is white, it's showing up as like a reddish outline on the camera, but normally it's white when it's on and running. And when the internet is down, it will turn to a bright red so that you know that the internet is down, that you should reboot your modem router, whatever it's called, or you should call your your internet, your internet service provider. 